everyone. Thank you for stopping by. Anyhow, um, oh wow, well. three. Okay, so they have a special going on right now for the um, stockable, stockable or washi tape and photo containers. So, I actually took advantage of getting me one. So what I got are the washi containers because right now, sorry about all that, this is where I saw my washi. I guess it works, but I mean, come on, why would you like to like put that in there? So anyhow, and I have more with the bins, like if I'm working with a project, I definitely like would um, just put it in whatever caddy I'm working on. So I, so that's 10 bucks and that would be 10 bucks till Saturday, I think. So I also got these for a project. I bought these at my Hobby Lobby um, haul to make that, um, sash belt for Miss Rana and she got it and she loved it so I happen to have something in mind anyhow just wanted to show you guys what the washi caddy is so what it is though it's kind of like the photo thing which the photo um organizers um or stackable whatever you call it um I own that and I put my ephemeras and or embellishment on it so you can pull these trays out which is awesome and they have um one, two, three, four, five, five each. They're deep enough. So um, you get four of these things right here that you can stack up like this. And this is my recollection. So it's like that. And then unlike the thing, cause like if you own that, um, what do you call this? The photo stack. It doesn't have this piece right here, but this, they have it. So you can still put like, you know, some washies in there. So, you know what? I think, and so this part has like that, I don't know if you guys can see, oh, horrible, oh, right there, ridges. So it has it right over here on the bottom. Mm -mm. Right here and right there. So if you actually put this one in here, it doesn't move away from you. So even if you only have one. So yeah, I guess that's nice. I only bought one because I wanted to try it. And then even like the top one, they still have the ridges so it doesn't move. So, and the fact that it's clear, you can see your washies, that's awesome. So what I would like to do is I would like to see like my biggest roll of washi right here if it fits. So the biggest one are these. I don't think these are washies. Um, are they washies? I got this at Tuesday morning. Well, I guess it is because it's like, you know, paper thingy. Anyhow, I would like to see if they fit in here. Oops, no, they don't fit like that way. They will fit this way. Hmm, now the next thing, and I don't think it will, but we shall say, those are only, I only got like, um, like three of these because they come three in a pack. Oop, so I guess they're going to go right there because they can actually be closed. So that's that. I will link a picture, or you know what? Comment down below if you would like to see how I would organize this. Um, so, yep, I got those. And then another thing that I got are these flowers, they are 70% off, so I have a DIY for the baby shower for that, this and this, so watch out for that, and comment down below if you want me to share it, and then on the clearance section, I actually, let me just see, so I got the $10, and then I got the daisy, this is $1.20, and then the felt 
Stein Feld. Oh, this one right here is 60 cents. And then I got these two pens right here are brush pens. I am not sure if they're different tips. So they I got it for a dollar thirty-seven. So I thought that that is pretty cool for my to, to like try it on. So this is what they look like right here. What are these? By they are by Kuri Take. They're Bimboji brush pen. Bimboji brush pen. So these I they said are these are water-based pigments and they are medium tip. And it's funny because the other one is also medium tip. Well, this is medium tip and this is medium brush tip. Anyhow, let's take a look at it. So that is the tip for one of them. And then I have my handy dandy pad right here from Dollar Tree. So let's see how they write. You know what? I'm gonna write in here. So I am not uh whoa. So yeah, so that's that. Hmm, pretty cool. It has that cap. It's pretty nice to write on. For like a dollar thirty-seven, yes, this is fun to have for my stash. So, like I said, I'm moving. Don't have any reason that I should do this, but heck. Okay, so this is the other one, and this says brush medium tip. Oh, I see. I might go back to get more. So now that we have it side by side, so this is one of them, and this is the other one. Oh, cute. Super cute. Okay. So, let's see how the brush pen is. Ooh. I do not. Oh, my God. It's super awesome. I am. I don't know how to do calligraphy, but this is the one with a wider tip, and this one is for this tip. This is awesome, and it already has the ink for it. So, this is good to, like kind of like practice you know if you wanted to do that hmm, I'm pretty happy with this one I might get a couple more because this is so fun hmm. I was like what is this this is interesting Ooh la la so these are originally $5.99 if you were to buy them um, when they're not on sale but for clearance out yes I'm gonna take them I did take them so Okay, so that's one of them, and then let me, so that's the stew pen right here. It says, yeah, $5. They just clearance it out on the fifth. Okay, so I got that. And then I also pick up these um, cream color, 65 pounds, and these are three and a half by eight three and three fourths by eight and seven eighths. So eight and seven eighths, three and three fourths. These were um, originally $5.99 by recollection. A hundred sheets in here, 65 um, pound per sheet. So I got it for $1.77. So yeah, yep, yep, yep. So happy to get these because this cream color will be perfect for like some of my die cuts. So, and then another thing that I got are these um, pom-poms. They are black. Um, they are an inch size. You get 15 pieces in this pack. And this thingy, my jigger, is 47 cents. So I picked it up for my collection. And then I also saw these two ribbons right here. These are just tiny, tiny spool of ribbons. You don't get much, you get five feet, um, and it's tiny. So 27 cents each, they were a dollar before. So they look like that. So I just thought that those are cute to get to my collection. So I didn't have 
a lot, like I said. But I really, really like the washi organizers. I'm thinking that I'm only going to do one. But we shall see. I believe I have more washies than this one. But I don't know yet. I will find out. I'm cleaning my craft room, taking everything out. Viewing starts tomorrow. So hopefully that will work out. But thank you guys for joining me and stopping by every single time shout out to matthew 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 i am so proud of you i am really really sad that you're leaving me but um they're very lucky to have you um just always remember what i thought you and what you've learned from the troy location and i'm pretty sure that you will do great things over there and um yeah it was an honor working with you and it was an honor um being your team leader so again thank you guys for watching and i will see you soon bye